extremely low temperatures, strong winds and endless snow-covered spaces. What does it take to survive in such conditions? Very warm and thick fur, camouflage color and, most importantly, the ability to get food. The hero of today's video is a patient, resourceful and very dexterous predator. The Arctic Fox. Let's start. The Arctic Fox is a predatory mammal of the fox genus, which is also called the polar fox. Relatively modest for a predator, the dimensions are limited to a body length of 75 centimeters and a height of 30 centimeters. The luxurious fluffy tail reaches half the body length and the mass is in the range of 3.5 kilograms. But sometimes very well-fed individuals are found weighing up to 9 kilograms. Fluffy animals live in the tundra and forest tundra zones beyond the Arctic Circle. This territory belongs to the northern part of Eurasia, North America and many islands of the Arctic Ocean. The Arctic Fox, in contrast to the Red Fox, has a short muzzle, rounded ears and long, thick fur that even covers the pads of the paws, which allows the animal to tolerate temperatures down to minus 70 degrees without consequences. But his wool not only saves in the harsh winter, but also perfectly disguises the animal against the background of monotonous landscapes. In the short summer, his fur acquires a reddish-black or brown color, and in winter, the Arctic fox dresses in a denser, thicker, and snow-white robe. Blue Arctic foxes are dark gray in winter. They are much less common, apart from some islands. Harsh living conditions don't give the right to choose prey. The Arctic fox has to feed on any animal caught in his tenacious teeth. In the summer, the predator can feast on berries and plants and the most resourceful arctic fox doesn't miss the opportunity to get protein, even from insects. But the main object of search for small predators is lemmings. These rodents are active all year round and in winter they are also in constant motion, digging passages under the thickness of the snow in search of previously hidden reserves. Animals need to have really outstanding sense of organs to sense the movement of such tiny mammals. Arctic foxes can't boast of the sharp vision of a predator, but they rely entirely on their excellent sense of smell and unique hearing. But how can they get the nimble rodent out of the snow? Here they can't do without special tactics. But an inexperienced fox needs a lot of practice to succeed. She crashes into the snow blanket over and over. Only the most patient hunter gets his prey sooner or later. The polar fox is forced to constantly move in search of food. In winter, the animal overcomes a distance of hundreds and sometimes thousands of kilometers. They have to be creative in order not to starve to death. Arctic foxes often risk their lives and chase polar bears, picking up food scraps after them. But in the summer, animals are sedentary, occupying areas of up to 20 square kilometers. Arctic foxes are solitary, but in the spring they form pairs to continue their kind. Animals dig holes, choosing the most secluded places that become home for future cubs, the number of which is highly dependent on the abundance of food. In hungry years, about five babies appear, but in favorable conditions, the number of puppies can reach 16, which is very unusual for predators. In addition, Parents can raise foster cubs. Babies grow quickly and parents are constantly looking for prey to feed so many hungry mouths. 
coming up with the most risky ways to get what they want. Birds are ideal to feed the entire family, but they are very alert and the animals need to be agile, fast and stealthy to get what they want. Hunting instincts awaken in puppies from infancy because they don't have much time to master this craft. Cubs at the age of three months are almost catching up to their parents' size and are already beginning to get food on their own, but they don't leave the family until the fall. However, each Arctic fox becomes completely independent by the beginning of migration. Many juveniles die, not having time to accumulate enough fat in the short summer to survive the long winter. Not only the strongest survive, but also the most resourceful. Someone will be lucky enough to catch the chick left unattended, while someone goes on a dangerous trip to the rocky coast, where thousands of birds arrange their nests. A young arctic fox approaches the nest in the hope of stealing an egg, but he is met by angry birds, whose sharp beak discourages any desire to attack. But the hunter doesn't give up, trying to get in from the rear, and he meets angry birds again. Agility and resourcefulness help a predator to steal an egg, but he will need more than a dozen of the same eggs in a week to survive. Arctic foxes often store food supplies so that they can return to their hiding place in times of famine. Life expectancy in captivity can be up to 15 years, but the Arctic fox rarely survives even to the age of six in the wild, where hunger reigns, predators and competitors live. The small size of the animal makes his an easy prey for wolverines, wolves and even large birds of prey. But the main enemy of the animal is man. After all, for many hundreds of years, people arrange a constant hunt for them because of their long, beautiful, and thick fur. Imagine just one fur coat costs the life of 20 animals that constantly balance between life and death, trying to survive in harsh climatic conditions. If you liked the video, do not forget to like and subscribe to the channel because your activity motivates us to create new interesting videos. Thank you for your attention and see you soon.